may not be worth my weight in gold. I wish I was, but I'm not. But I do have a word of caution when it comes to investing in it, especially during the worst financial crisis since the Great Depression. It's little wonder that more and more people are thinking about putting their money in the gold. It's a traditional safe haven against turmoil and uncertainty. But how about a little perspective? If you adjust for inflation, gold would have to reach over $2,224 an ounce to best its previous peak of $850 an ounce in 1980. It now trades in the low 700s. So when it comes to savings, especially retirement savings, there is no pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. And yes, I did really say that. Now here's why I don't like gold. It's a pure speculation on a price increase. You're betting that the price you bought it today, you're gonna to sell it at a higher price tomorrow. But if it's in your IRA, gold doesn't pay dividends. There's no cash flow. So it's not an appropriate investment for the long-term investor. If you want to own gold, do it outside of your retirement savings account. You could buy an exchange traded fund. It's a very cost efficient way to own gold. And there's some mutual funds that focus on the precious metal. The counterpoint to my perspective on gold comes from mutual fund maestro Jean-Marie Evillard. He has a terrific long-term track record. And he's run the first Eagle Global Fund for more than a quarter century. Like many wealthy Europeans, he always keeps a small percentage of the portfolio in gold. The idea is this, stocks plummet, gold rises in price, and that cushions the overall value of the portfolio. It's a hedge against turmoil. So if you want to keep a small percentage of your portfolio in gold, that's okay with me. But I still prefer treasury bills and treasury inflation protected securities. These are investments that preserve capital and make you some money. No one will get rich with these securities, but the value of a dollar will be preserved. Remember, all that glitters is not gold. And yes, I managed to come up with another cliche. And right now, I bet you're thinking, silence is golden. For Marketplace Money, I'm Chris Farrell.